Hey guys, it's Anne, and this is the first episode of This Is Not A Book. This Is Not A Book is a book which is written by Carrie Smith, and she's actually one of my favorite authors. Um, she is the one that wrote This Is Not A Book, and also wrote this journal, which I also really like doing. Before doing anything, I'm going to be doing the front cover, and I basically draw these little doodles, I guess you could call them, um, on the front cover, and I'm going to outline them using a black gel pen. The book doesn't necessarily um, tell me to decorate the front cover, but I wanted to because I kind of thought that the cover looked blank. Also, the back cover, I'm going to do that also. But starting with the front cover, um, I chose to do these little doodles um, because in my create this book, I colored in the whole front cover. And also in my create this book too, I colored in the whole front cover. So for this not a book, I decided to do doodling. And I just outlined the doodles because I didn't want to make this front cover colorful. So after I'm done with the front cover, I can move on to the back cover. And for the back cover, I did doodles. Um, and I'm going to outline them using a white gel pen this time. And I chose to use white gel pens because I thought white would look better on top of red than black. And the reason I used black on the front cover is because I forgot that I had ordered white gel pens when I was doing the front cover. Um, I was supposed to do white, um, white doodles for the front and the back cover and the black looked good but the white looked so much better um and i regret forgetting that i ordered white gel pens and just using black um but there's no going back and i'm so happy with the front cover after that to avoid any smudging or the paint sorry i just called it paint it's not paint the ink coming off, I used packing tape to secure the front and the back cover. After I'm done with the front and the back cover, I moved on to the title page and it says it's not a book and there's also a really big thumb over there. Yep, and it's a lot bigger than mine, which is weird. But for the title page, I used watercolor and a sponge to color in the whole page using a pattern of pink, purple, and blue, and this page is super simple, but I really like the effect that it had. The next page is the copyright page, and for the copyright page, I decided to do stripes um, in a pattern of pink, purple, blue, and green, and I didn't just use the raw colors, I actually used the pastel versions of each and every color and after that I went ahead with a silver Posca pen and outlined the stripes that really made everything come together. Since I don't really have anything to talk about, I'm going to tell you guys that I officially have an Instagram now. I actually had an Instagram for quite some time, but I didn't tell you guys. And I didn't really post anything until just recently, so if you want to check it out, my username is underscore and underscore outlet. Okay, back to the video topic. Um, I drew a boy holding in this note a book because um, the stripes were looking kind of blank and they were looking just like stripes and nothing else. So I drew this boy holding a this note a book um, in his hand and I just drew him, colored him in, outlined him using a Sharpie and then just glued him onto the page. Also, I nearly forgot about the edges, so I'm going to do the edges now. There isn't any instructions on the book saying that I need to color the edges, but I thought the edges were blank because the edges were just white, and I colored them in in a pattern of pink, purple, blue, and green. After I'm done with the edges, I'm going to go back to the copyright page, and for the page where it says no to the reader slash user, I'm just going to add some stars and hearts, and I'm done with the page. I just kept the page super simple and super easy. Okay, so after the copyright page, I'm going to go back to the title page and do the left side of the title page. Please forgive me if this video is a bit messy, I'm actually showing you guys the order that I did this video, like filmed this video in real life, and this is how I did it actually. 
So for this page, I decided to do donuts, a bunch of them, um, with different colored frostings and different decorations on top. For the pink donut, I did chocolate drizzles. For the red donut, I did um, rainbow sprinkles. For the orange donut, I did chocolate balls or polka dots. For the purple donut, it's chocolate drizzles, also but in like a different different type of chocolate drizzle, more like a chocolate syrup. For the yellow donut, it's nuts. For the green donut, it's rainbow sprinkles, but in like ball form, so basically rainbow balls. Um, for the blue donut, it's chocolate sprinkles, and for the salmon donut, it's chocolate drizzles. Moving on to the first page with an actual um, instruction on it. This page says, this is an inconvenience. Take this note of book everywhere you go for one week. You must place it in full view at all times. I actually got my this note of book six days ago, so it's been like nearly a week since I've been taking this note of book out. I'm not going to show you me taking out this note of book everywhere I go, but I actually did that. So for this page, I try to create an inconvenience scenario. So this guy is locked out of the car with the key inside the car. And this is a pretty big inconvenience though. This kind of situation is pretty rare, but it can happen to you if you're a bit forgetful. Um, but it never happened ever in my life, but... Okay, so there's also another inconvenience. There's a bird who's pooping on top of the, the person's head. So, person has bird poop on top of his head, and also he's locked out of his car. Fun fact. No, it's actually not fun at all. Not a fun fact. Not a fun fact. A bird actually pooped on my head once it was in the first period um before it was before school was gonna start a bird pooped on my head and i wiped the poop off but still it didn't really like wash my hair or something so i had to keep that bird poop on top of my head for the rest of the day which was pretty disgusting but this is a little recap for all the pages that i did and the cover and the back cover obviously if you like this video, please consider subscribing, like the video, and if you share it, it will make me really happy. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!